Hi, I'm Philip Pringle and um, I've been playing solo drums for quite a while now. I'm in Cape Town, South Africa and I play with a couple bands here. I play with the Johnny Cooper big band and um, I also play with the Trilli Trilogy Music Jazz Band. I've also done a fair amount of classical work and I play with, uh, with, with some classical groups every now and again. And I'm the head of music at Western Province Prep School and I also teach percussion and drums at Bishop's College in Cape Town. So I'm originally from Port Elizabeth and um, I studied music all the way through school and played in a whole lot of bands at school and then I moved up to Cape Town and I studied here at UCT. At UCT I spent four years studying with Frank Hallows who taught me a lot of the basics of music and um, reading really well. And I spent a year with Efren Toro who is an international drumming icon which was an incredible experience. Through the years I've um, listened to a lot of Peter Erskine, he's probably one of my biggest artists I listen to. And then I like um, Steve Smith. Dave Wickle, Steve Gadd, and um, into some of the kind of other younger guys. Um, Benny Greb is awesome. I like Jojo Mayer and also Gavin Harrison, who also happen to be solo artists. So some of the favorite artists I listen to, um, I've been listening to Sting and to Dave Matthews for quite a few years, to Hiromi, who's a new pianist, who's got some incredible stuff out. Also listen to um, quite a lot of Steve Smith, Fight Information groups, enjoying listening to them. I've been playing solo drums for six years now. Um, they just stood out to me. Firstly, it was the look of the drums, and um, they just brought me to it, and then I realized they also sound the best. So, more, sound is more important, and so I'm glad they have both. So, the first kit I picked up was actually after Steve Smith's clinic. I picked up the Sono Jungle kit, which he played on in the clinic, and I've been playing that for six years. Um, it's awesome for all my um, trio gigs I do, and um, since then, I've also bought the new Martini kit, which is a small bass drum 14 inch, the size of this snare drum and um, even easier to carry around but still has a nice big fat solid sound which um, can fill up a decent sized venue. So this snare drum comes from the Sono SQ2 kit that I have and um, it's a vintage maple shell which means it's the thinnest of the shells that Sono makes um, and it's got a reinforcement tube just to, to help with the durability. Um, it's got a really nice fat warm sound. This one is fitted with die cast hoops which give it an extra crack and so especially when you give a rim shot you, you can really hear it. But it's a five and a half inch deep so it's got that solid fat sound at the same time. Other things outside of drumming, I like to spend some time with my family. I've got a little two-year-old which I run around with and love spending some time at the family farm and um, spend some time out on the dam or kayaking, it's wonderful. And I um, also like to get involved in some sports, especially team sports like some tennis and some golf is also nice.